Hello and welcome to TSC News Desk. I'm Tim Hoffman reporting. The latest twist and turn in the Brett Favre saga has come from the Green Bay Packers as they are now accusing the Minnesota Vikings of tampering with their star QB, who is still looking to come out of retirement. Tampering, of course, against league rules when one team contacts a player who is still under contract with his existing team, and apparently the Vikings have done that with Favre, although Favre and his agent both dispute the claim that anything wrong was done. And, uh, in fact, here on TSC, the sports comedian, we have an exclusive interview with Brett Favre, and we thank you for joining us here. He joins us live via satellite, and uh, he's here to dispute the allegations. He says he was not contacted by the Vikings in any way. Brett, it is an honor to have you, and we... Just look for some clarification on what's happened here. Well, thank you very much, Tim. I'm uh, I'm glad to be here. Brett, what are you what are you wearing right now? Well, it's a it's a hat. You know, it's very uh, very windy out here, so I thought I'd put on just a normal cap that I'd wear out anywhere. I see. Uh, Brett, it looks like you're on a boat right now. Is that true? Yeah, we are. We are, uh, we're heading to Norway, actually. Going to take a trip with the wife, uh, you know, do some spear fishing, maybe see some Nordic opera. There's just so much to do in such a great country like Norway. All right, fair enough. But to get to the issue at hand, Brett, um, have the Vikings contacted you in any way? Have they influenced you in any such fashion? Because what I'm seeing uh, kind of looks like they have. No, no, they definitely have not been tampered with me, Tim. It's like my all-time favorite player, Fran Tarkenton, used to say, and that's, you can't let anyone stop you from being you. And as everyone knows, I have always been into the sea, and I've been into unshaven women for years. I mean, you should see my wife, Tim. It's like a shrubbery down there. That is way too much information. I love to get lost in a vaginal forest. All right, moving on. Uh, Brett, we have to ask you about your play with the Packers in the upcoming season. What? What is that? What is that noise? Oh, just me, Tim. Oh, I've bitten off a chunk of raw lamb meat. I don't. I don't know. I don't know what's happening right now. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, nothing gets me going <laughs> like a little lamb. Oh God. Oh, it's so good. But this is what the baby Jesus would taste like if he were, if he were a food. Mm. Oh. Oh. oh, it's so chewy and bloody. Oh, oh, my stomach feels all tingly, like there's magic inside it. Oh, it's probably salmonella, actually. Oh, well, don't worry about that. I should be okay, Tim. I'm going to a land populated by Vikings. All right, not some useless profession like cheese packers. Well, it's a bold statement, Brett. Obviously, uh, you've not been tampered with. You have proved us all wrong here. you proved the Packers wrong. And uh, I thank you for your time in this interview and enjoy it out there on, uh, on the sea or whatever you're going to do. Well, thank you very much, Tim. It's, it's been a pleasure being here. Uh, have, a, have a good day.